This is the second date update on the 10 with Ramiro, Pebbles, and Melissa, the Get Up Crew. Hot 96.9. Hi, Anna. How can we help you, madam? Hi. So I, I'm just calling because I want to follow up uh, on a date I recently went to. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we met on cooking class, and then I invited him for dinner at my place. I was cooking, and we had a great time. Yeah. How great of a time? Like, really good. Like, like he spent the night great of a time? Yes, of course. Oh, oh okay, about. okay, 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 okay. So what, what happened? So he was gone. I he was gone? See, he was, yeah, I tried to look for him in the rest of the house. Like, the kitchen was a disaster. <laughs> the kitchen was a disaster? Yes. Things I had not even seen in my life, like, were popping up in my kitchen. Just cabinets were open. Um, I think he went through my recycling. Um, <laughs> Did he rob you? But, you know, what? I, no, I, everything checked out, but... He did cook for me. He, uh, there were some scrambled eggs on the counter. Oh, so he's just so, a messy cook. So you just, so, like, left your kitchen a mess, right? That's what it sounds like? Well, I, I saw that my front door was open, so I thought he was out to get something that he had, you know, needed. But I tried calling him and nothing. Like, he, no response. And you haven't heard from him since then? I haven't heard from him since then. So you guys had a great night. He spent the night. Sex took place, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. The next morning, he made you eggs, ma- left the mess in your kitchen, left your front door, and just left your house. Correct. I hope he answers the phone. H- hang on, Anna, okay? All right. All right. Hello? Is this Ramon? Is this? <laughs> we got Ram- <laughs> Ramon. New it's, phone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Romero, Pebbles, and Melissa. We're calling you from Hot 96.9, the radio station. The radio station, okay. Y- yes. What do you want? Uh, well, we wanted mm-hmm. to talk to you because we got your phone number from a girl that wanted us to call you so we can ask you out on a date on her behalf. This is really sketchy. I don't, what do you say to Okay. A girl told you to call me from a radio station? I don't know anyone from a radio station. No, 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 no. Okay, he's half listening. That's good. Okay, so, (laughs) no, no, we got your phone number from a girl, okay? It's a girl you know, and I'm going to tell you her name. So, basically, she just wants to ask you out on a date, and and if you say yes, if you agree to the date, we'll pay for whatever date you choose. So, like, you can pick the restaurant, you know, you can let us know, like, whatever day you're free. If you want to do, like, a Tuesday afternoon, whatever, we'll we'll pay for everything. We'll reserve everything, and you just show up, you, you know, you have a good meal, you have some good drinks and you just see if you and this girl hit it off that's it okay uh as long as i get to pick the place but who's the girl <laughs> who's the girl okay so this is good so it's a girl that you actually hung out with already you guys had a good time according to her anna 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 the muffin girl the, the muffin girl? the muffin girl <laughs> yeah i i hung out with her uh the night before and she made me dinner we hung out we banged and then the next morning, oh, I woke up before her, so I was like, I'll just make her breakfast, you know, to, like, return the favor. She cooked me a meal, I'll cook her a meal. Yeah. And then I started cooking, I was going to the kitchen, and I saw this muffin, right? And I ate the muffin, no problem. Uh-huh. Started cooking eggs, and then, like, 10 minutes after I ate the muffin, I started to get this real weird feeling. Uh-huh. So, like, I I didn't know what was going on. I'm like, there was something that muffin, I think, I don't know. He's, like, left it there, like, on a plate with a little doily. Like, she wanted me to eat it. And then I saw all this shit started going through my head. Like, I can't find my keys now. <laughs> Did she hide my keys? Like, I don't know what is going on. So I got really sketched out, and I just bolted, and I just ran home. <laughs> You ran home? <laughs> yeah. Hold on a second. <laughs> what uh, is uh, happening? And, and Ramon, Anna's on the phone. Oh, man. She's on the phone? Hi. Yeah. Anna. Yes, I'm here. So, wh- wh- <laughs> what's your deal? Yeah, wh- wh- what is he talking about? <laughs> Why is she on the phone? Why are you on the phone, Anna? Dude, I, I had a great time with you. I thought you did, too. 
you disappeared on me. You know, you even left your shoes, and I can't believe you ran or <laughs> nine, nine miles. This is getting weirder and weirder. You <laughs> ran out of our house with no shoes? Dude, I didn't even... Re- yeah, that's why my feet are all f***ed up. I didn't even realize I left my shoes over there. What? Where did you do, what did you do with my key? And what did you put in that muffin? Up this is like oh my god yeah <laughs> that must have been the the weed blueberry muffins so they're strong the weed blueberry muffins and I, I make them for my brother and his friends they pay me and i you know i bake them cookies and muffins and i make pasta and all with weed like in that. it yes so you just leave weed food lying around for people to just eat? Like, you just leave food with drugs in it? Just sitting around your apartment? Yeah. I assume my brother had taken everything, so... <laughs> hold on, hold on. <laughs> Anna, can I ask a question? Yeah. Did you happen to have one of those muffins this morning? Because you sound like you're high <laughs> as shit. No offense. Um, I had some wheat pizza last night. I think it's so. Okay. That's that, a thing. That, makes sense. that explains it. <laughs> what, yo, what do you do? So, okay, Sprinkle it on top? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Forget the oregano. Yeah. So, Ramon, you just had. Anyway, I'm. Yeah. <laughs> this makes perfect. date. Yeah. Do you want to do a second wow. date? So, that's what it is. You had a muffin that had weed in it, and that caused you to freak out and run to you. How far do you live from uh, Anna's house? Bro, I don't know. Like, she lives in Boston. Mm. I live in Braintree. I don't know. Yeah, it's that's like, like 10 miles. Forever. Yeah, 10 miles? Yeah, it's 10. That's you about, ran 10 miles yeah. barefoot. I don't know, dude. I guess so. I, I felt like f***ing death was chasing me. I was I was just terrified. <laughs> I didn't even realize I didn't have shoes on. It. <laughs> and you, I got so, home. My feet are like bloody. And I was just tweaking the whole night, looking out my windows. And I felt like this girl works for the government. She's like, she drugged me or something. I didn't know what was going on. I couldn't find my keys. I had to climb into my house through my bathroom window because I didn't have my key to my door. <laughs> so you cl- so you ran 10 Dude, miles barefoot he, and, yeah. and broke into your own house. Pretty much, yeah. He I clearly had didn't have an end game there. Those muffins sound yeah, amazing. Yeah, because now you need to figure out how you get your <laughs> yeah. keys back. Yeah, so you guys should go out on another date just so Anna could give you your shoes oh, and your keys back. No. <laughs> Look, I'll send you my address and... Send me my key. Actually, I'm going to give you my P.O. box. I don't want you having my address. Just <laughs> send my key and my shoes to my P.O. box. The second date update on the 10th. Weekday mornings at 610, 710, and 810. If you need a second date update, email us. Get up crew at hot969boston.com. Want to know how to get the best cannabis for the best price? Come on, make love. Best day.